It is an understatement to suggest the world's population is increasing at a very fast rate. That comes with concerns about food availability and security. Climate change is causing fresh water to become perhaps the planet's most scarce resource, with attendant threats to sustainable life. Drought in most parts of the world, including Ghana, gives people two options, to continue talking or start acting. Imagine Ghana turning this vast land in the north into greenery. How about Ghana using underground seawater and solar panels to make this happen, produce fresh food, enough water, energy to sustain the local population? Achieving this, especially with commercially viable technology, may sound unrealistic. A young man here at Abuantem in Ashanti region is, however, already making it a reality in the face of difficulty. Mostly, I cultivate about three acres of carrot. Cabbage is just an additional crop that I do. I make a lot of profit on carrot cultivation, but this is not the best time to cultivate the crop. The vegetables are grown here. Water is drawn from a nearby river to regain the farm. Every year, Yahweh Fuye and his workers, with the aid of water holes, pipe water daily onto the crops' dry season farming. If one decides to invest about 15,000 Ghana cities into carrot cultivation, they are likely to get 30,000 cities. But for these women in various types of vegetable and crop cultivation at Kulungungu in the Upper East region, the white water provides a great relief. It's therefore worrying the river is gradually drying up. After harvesting, we consume all the farm produce. Sometimes bad weather affects the growth of our crops and vegetables. We need support from the government. It worries me a lot because when it does not rain, we don't get food to feed our family. Scientists say it has the effect of climate change. The little rain flood, drought comes, a long spell of drought, and the little rain torrential, it rains shortly but heavy to the extent that it can even uh, destroy properties and humans' lives. Though things look good for these women compared to others elsewhere, it will be much better for them if this river continues to provide water as before. The rains do not come anymore. We are uncertain whether what we have already planted will grow or not. It is really a challenge. It will no longer be easy, especially at the time the Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change released reports on expected severe weather condition in the near future. As the country nears an era of feeding extra mouths as a result of the growing population, the story might not be that pleasant. A report by Mohamed Nuruddin for Joy News.